Today I'll show you how to stream the video from an IP camera to a TV using a laptop and the Chromecast. So basically, the video leaves the camera, goes to a laptop, to the Chromecast and to the TV using their TSP protocol. Wanna learn more? Just keep watching! Hello, welcome to my channel, Claudemir here, and today I will show you how to stream the video for your IP camera to a TV using the Chromecast and their TSP protocol. But before I continue, don't forget to subscribe to this channel, hit the thumbs up, hit the bell notification, and leave your comments. So back here, we can see that we have an IP camera, that of course you need to power it up, just connect the power to your camera, and then you connect to a, an outlet. And then basically you're gonna use the router to connect also to your camera using a UTP cable, a network cable. And from there, you can have access from your laptop because your laptop is also connected to your network. You need to also to connect your Chromecast to the same network. So basically the Chromecast can be connected to a TV. Doesn't matter if it's a smart TV or not because Chromecast can use the HDMI connection to a TV and then your TV can receive the stream from your camera, okay, using the Chromecast. So the idea here is that you have a Wi-Fi that connects to your Chromecast and then the Chromecast, the laptop and the TV, everybody is in the same network, also the IP camera is in the same network, so the stream can leave your camera, come to your router and then comes to your laptop, to the Chromecast and to the TV. So basically that's the way it works. Now let's do some practice and see that working. Okay, so I'm going to use the VLC software to get the stream from the camera and then VLC can stream to my Chromecast. Basically what I need here is their TSP command. I have two of them here, one for the Zossi camera and one from a Samsung IP camera. So I'll get the Samsung one first this command you can find on your menu or you can um, use a software to find the command, right? So here I'm just grabbing the RTSP and here I can go to media, open network stream and just paste it here, hit play. And then I need to use the user and password. Let me type the user and password here and hit OK. And here we go. Let me just adjust th this screen and here we go I have the streaming from from the IP camera from the Samsung IP camera and th this camera is located a little bit a little bit back from the Zossi camera so they're in the same room you see the Zossi camera here but this image is for the Samsung camera okay so now let's get the image from the Zossi camera that's out there also here I have the screen uh, the RTSP stream so I just copy it and come here. I can open another VLC and I do the same process here in media, open network stream. I just paste here and hit play. And in this case, it's configured to go directly, right? Don't ask for a user and a password. So I have here the stream from the Zossi camera and one from Samsung, okay? So let me just show you guys both of them here. And now I can grab any of those and stream directly to my TV. So back here I have my TV and here at the top I have the information about which TV it is, which device it is for, uh, because Chromecast is connected to this TV, right? So here's TV2. So I can find here on playback, renderer. Here I have a lot of different devices. So I'm going to pick here TV2 and as soon as I hit here, this goes to black and I can see on my TV that starts streaming. I see the RTSP command here and then streams the video there on the TV. So it's pretty easy, pretty simple. Back here on the computer, we can see that I have just a black screen here. The Samsung camera is still there streaming using VLC. I could do the same and stream also to the Chromecast, right? So as soon as I close this application like this, if you see on the TV, it goes away, right? So the idea is that you can't close the application, otherwise you're gonna lose the stream for from your camera, okay? So that's the way you can use RTSP to send to your computer 
and to your TV. And there, there is a lot of different application for TSP. You can learn more here in this channel. There's a lot of video talking about TSP. You can stream to a cloud or can stream to your website and make a lot of different uses of RTSP command, right? So if you like this video, just leave your thumbs up, leave your, also your comments, subscribe to the channel, and also hit the bell notification to receive more information about videos like this. Thank you very much, and I see you in the next one.